Also, from the iPad to Xbox, your kids are plugged in. So why are some of the biggest minds in technology unplugging their kids on purpose? You want to know a secret? Some of the tech world's biggest gurus are actually sending their own children to schools without a single computer. They're called Waldorf schools, and they are unplugged on purpose. Fox 29's Karen have visited a Waldorf in our area where they think children should explore without a tablet in their hands. Philadelphia's Waldorf School is in Mount Airy. The philosophy isn't just low tech, it's no tech. There are no computers, no batteries, nothing that beeps. It's totally unplugged. The most obvious thing you realize is all of the toys. There's no electronics, no beeps. They have things that are made of felt, you know, real wood. And kids can use them together. Pine cones. This is a, their nature table. And they also have a PlayStation over here that kids can create the objects themselves. Here they've got a marble roll. Over here they've taken these enormous blocks and made them into a, a balance beam. And they can actually move the furniture. These children have created a, a little fort to just hang out in lead foot that sewing machine toot your recorder this old time stuff and old time values is from an old time movement it was created way back in germany in 1919 and it has just become the hot new thing for parents that are fed up with all the noise the absence of media and, and not even technology so much kids are relentlessly marketed to from the time they're born if you go to the supermarket and there's just things everywhere movie trailers, there's on yogurt containers, I mean it's just every every place you look and this school had none of that. Technology is great and and there's a time and a place for everything uh, but a computer is also just a tool, it's not a method. Hi. The Waldorf philosophy is to let the natural world be the playground, to explore and create and imagine, put the good stuff in, get the good stuff out, literally. Check out this soup. This smells amazing. One of the things they do at the school every single day is work together as a team to make a homemade organic vegetarian snack and even the kids have to help. Here they are ripping up some pieces of spinach, chopping up the vegetables. They draw their textbooks. It's a picture of Krishna and his mom. And sing their math. 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, 42. But What's the point of knitting? I feel like you learn patience and like how to sort of calm yourself down. Knitting doesn't take a lot of effort, but it's just something that can like relax you. And once you're done, you have something beautiful. Yes. <laughs> These parents aren't haters. They just think that young children learn best without all those bells and whistles. They have all of it, you know. It, we just have clear rules. There's Monday through Friday, there's no media. And they, that's what they do. Do you miss not having the technology in your classroom? No, <laughs> I think that it's just kind of a distraction sometimes and it's just like you can focus on what the teacher is saying. I mean, I can do computer stuff at home. So what's it all cost? Well, at Waldorf, Philadelphia, it's about $12,000, but half of their students do get financial aid. If you're interested in learning more, just come to our website. There were also schools in Kimberton, Chester County and Princeton, New Jersey. I'm Karen Hepp, Fox 29.